A twin prime is a prime number that has a prime gap of 2. In other words, to qualify as a twin prime, the prime number must be either 2 less or 2 more than another prime number. For example, the twin prime pair 2 is not considered a twin prime with the number 3, since it violates the aforementioned rule. Sometimes the term twin prime is used for a pair of twin primes. An alternative name for this is prime twin or prime pair. Twin primes appear despite the general tendency of gaps between adjacent primes to become larger as the numbers themselves get larger due to the prime number theorem. History the question of whether there exist infinitely many twin primes has been one of the great open questions in number theory for many years. This is the content of the twin prime conjecture, which states, there are infinitely many primes p such that p plus 2 is also prime. In 1849, de Polignac made the more general conjecture that for every natural number k, there are infinitely many prime pairs p and p such that p minus p equals 2k. The case k equals 1 is the twin prime conjecture. A stronger form of the twin prime conjecture, the hardy little word conjecture, postulates a distribution law for twin primes akin to the prime number theorem. On April 17, 2013, Yitang Zhang announced a proof that for some integer n that is less than 70 million, there are infinitely many pairs of primes that differ by n. Zhang's paper was accepted by Annals of Mathematics in early May 2013. Terence Dow subsequently proposed a polymath project collaborative effort to optimize Zhang's bound. As of April 14, 2014, one year after Zhang's announcement, according to the polymath project wiki, the bound has been reduced to 246. Further, assuming the elliott halberstam conjecture and its generalized form, the Polymath Project Wiki states that the bound has been reduced to 12 and 6, respectively. These improved bounds were discovered using a different approach that was simpler than Zhang's and was discovered independently by James Maynard and Terence Tao. This second approach also gave bounds for the smallest f needed to guarantee that infinitely many intervals of width f contain at least m primes. Brun's theorem. In 1915, Bigot Brun showed that the sum of reciprocals of the twin primes was convergent. This famous result, called Brun's theorem, was the first use of the Brun sieve and helped initiate the development of modern sieve theory. The modern version of Brun's argument can be used to show that the number of twin primes less than n does not exceed for some absolute constant c greater than zero. Other theorems weaker than the twin prime conjecture. In 1940, Paul Erdos showed that there is a constant c less than 1 and infinitely many primes p such that less than where p denotes the next prime after p. This result was successively improved. In 1986, Helmut Mayer showed that a constant c less than 0.25 can be used. In 2004 Daniel Goldston and Sem Yildirim showed that the constant could be improved further to c equals 0 0.085786. In 2005, Goldston, Janus Pince and Yildirim established that c can be chosen to be arbitrarily small by assuming the elliott halberstam conjecture or a slightly weaker version. They were able to show that there are infinitely many n such that at least 2 of n, n plus 2, n plus 6, n plus 8, n plus 12, n plus 18, or n plus 20 a prime. Under a stronger hypothesis they showed that for infinitely many n, at least 2 of n, n plus 2, n plus 4, and n plus 6 a prime. The result of Zhang is a major improvement on the Goldston Graham Pint's Yildirim result. The polymath project optimization of Zhang's bound and Maynard claims to have reduced the bound to n equals 246 of further improvements. Every twin prime pair except is of the form for some natural number n, and with the exception of n equals 1, n must end in 0, 2, 3, 5, 7, or 8. A002822 It has been proven that the pair is a twin prime if and only if if m minus 4 or m plus 6 is also prime then the three primes are called a prime triplet. 
largest known twin prime pair. On January 15, 2007, two distributed computing projects, Twin Prime Search and Prime Grid found the largest known twin primes. 2,003,663,613,2,195,000 plus or minus 1. The numbers have 58,711 decimal digits. Their discoverer was Eric Vautier of France. On August 6, 2009, those same two projects announced that a new record twin prime had been found. It is 65,516,468,355-2,333,333 plus or minus 1. The numbers have 100,355 decimal digits. On December 25, 2011, Prime Grid announced that yet another record twin prime had been found. It is 3,786,801,695,685,2,666,669 plus or minus 1. The numbers have 200,700 decimal digits. An empirical analysis of all prime pairs up to 4.351015 shows that if the number of such pairs less than x is fx, 2 then f is about 1.7 for small x and decreases towards about 1.3 as x tends to infinity. There are 808,675,888,577,436 twin prime pairs below 1018. The limiting value of f is conjectured to equal twice the twin prime constant A114907. This conjecture would imply the twin prime conjecture, but remains unresolved. The twin prime conjecture would give a better approximation, as with the prime counting function, by properties. The first few twin prime pairs are A077800. The only even prime is 2, except for the pair. Twin primes are as closely spaced as possible for two primes. Every third odd number is divisible by 3, which requires that no three successive odd numbers can be prime unless one of them is 3. 5 is therefore the only prime that is part of two pairs. Along the same lines, other than the first pair, the number centered between the twin primes must always be divisible by 6. The lower member of a pair is by definition a Chern prime. First Hardy-Littlewood conjecture. The Hardy-Littlewood conjecture is a generalization of the twin prime conjecture. It is concerned with the distribution of prime constellations, including twin primes, in analogy to the prime number theorem. Let pi 2 denote the number of primes px such that p plus 2 is also prime. Define the twin prime constant C2 as A005597. Then the conjecture is that in the sense that the quotient of the two expressions tends to 1 as n approaches infinity. This conjecture can be justified by assuming that 1 lane t describes the density function of the prime distribution, an assumption suggested by the prime number theorem. poline yaks conjecture poline yaks conjecture from 1849 states that for every positive even natural number k, there are infinitely many consecutive prime pairs p and p such that p minus p equals k. The case k equals 2 is the twin prime conjecture. The conjecture has not yet been proven or disproven for any specific value of k, but Zhang's result proves that it is true for at least one value of k. Indeed, if such a k did not exist, then for any positive even natural number n there are at most finitely many n such that pn plus 1 pn equals m for all m less than n and so for n large enough we have pn plus 1 pn greater than n, which would contradict Zhang's result. Isolated prime. An isolated prime is a prime number p such that neither p minus 2 nor p plus 2 is prime. In other words, p is not part of a twin prime pair. 
For example, 23 is an isolated prime, since 21 and 25 are both composite. The first few isolated primes are 2, 23, 37, 47, 53, 67, 79, 83, 89, 97, AO075100.